what a day. Joined by Kara DeMott. Kara, I just want you to step over here and take a look at those numbers. You were shaking your head looking at it. I keep checking it to make sure that that's what I ran. I just can't believe this. I'm just, I'm really tired, but I'm really, really happy. That clock ain't moving. 2.19.12. It's not only the course record for the Chevron Women's Marathon, it's the American record. <laughs> it's like, I can't. Part of me just can't believe this is happening. And the other part is like, is this happening because you've worked your tail off, Kira? You've worked so hard to get here. And then, but like, what? <laughs> just feel like dreams come true, you know? It makes the dream even better. We saw the emotion at the finish line. Your husband, your children, Tommy and Quinn, the embrace. They know how hard mom worked. Take us through that moment. Yeah, I mean, they see me day in and day out leave for a run and come back a, like hour or two later so they've been part of this journey and part of the sacrifice and when I crossed the line and they were there oh man I just it's just one of the happiest moments of my life outside of like the day I had them I guess gotta put my wedding day up there too but then this is following that I just can't believe this is happening as a general rule we're not supposed to talk about a woman's age but you're 37 I am. It's old to many, but the fact that you are 37 and you have Tommy and Quinn here to see this, to be part of the journey, I imagine that makes it worth it. It's it's so special, you know, to think that this dream was gone a decade ago and somehow I just believe that, you know, age is just a number and it just doesn't even matter how old you are, you can chase your dreams and I'm just so fortunate to have a family that supported that. But yeah, <laughs> I just saw. Oh. Wow. <laughs> That's a good word for it. Now, uh, this was your first time running the Chevron Houston Marathon here. You've run the half. Obviously, you blistered the course, the impressions of the course today and the race today. The race is amazing. It, the course is so fast. I could have, I would have been fine with a little less win, but the, just the way it's organized and going through the cities and the neighborhoods and just the community came out and supported so much and I needed it all. I felt, didn't feel great doing that, but there's, you know, I guess it wasn't supposed to be easy, but just hearing the people cheer, you know, and they didn't even know who I was, but they were out there cheering on their lawns and everything. I'm just so appreciative. I love Houston. This is now probably my favorite city in the world. <laughs> But um, yeah, thank you for having me to your great city. And um, yeah. We are we are proud of this. Want to bring another special guest on stage. This is Tommy. Tommy, do you know what that sign says, bud? You're number one in my heart. <laughs> well, she's also number one in the record books. Your mom just set the American record. Do you know the significance of that, bud? What does this feel like? To see it's like, this is so cool, because it's like, Kind, it's kind of like mom's famous, and it's cool to have a famous mother or father. She's very famous, and you know how hard she works, don't you? You see her putting in that effort, don't you? Yeah. What was that hug like at the finish line with mom? Um, well, it felt great to finally have her back. I love you so much. <laughs> Tommy, have you ever seen your mom wear a cowboy hat? Uh, no. <laughs> you want to change that, bud? Let's change that right now. Come on in. Hello. Good morning. T tell us exactly who you are and what you're about to do on behalf of Chevron. So my name is Talisa Tolliver, and I'm just so happy and proud to be here. I want to congratulate you on an incredible performance, and we're just glad to be here to support the community uh, and support Chevron and our marathon runners. So uh, just glad to be here and want to congratulate her more than anything. Thank you. I'm going to hand this to you. All right, put this bad boy on. Yeah! <laughs> I think it fits, y'all. Kira D'Amato, the 50th anniversary of the Chevron Houston Marathon, our champion, our new record holder, and she looks pretty darn good in a cowboy hat, if I may say so myself. We'll send it back to y'all. She looks great in a cowboy hat, Adam. It's yeah. kind of like Mom's Famous. Yeah, yeah kind of like. Kind of yeah. like. People all over the world will be talking about her performance, a new American record.